I'm Jeanette Gaines from Jewelry Arts Inc. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use this cute little tool. It's called a margin roller. It's something you use on your flex shaft. Um, it's basically like a spinning burnisher. So you know how sometimes when you're designing a project or you're making a project and you end up with just sort of sheet at the edge, like there isn't like a wire there or anything, or like a fold form piece, or maybe you're making like this lovely little example, like a little leaf earring like this with the texture. And at the edge, it can, if there isn't anything there, if there isn't like a wire there or something, it tends to feel a little sharp, even if you sand it and polish it and whatever, it just feels a little unfinished. So basically what the margin roller does is uh, the metalsmithing term is called upsetting, actually. It thickens up the edge, which I think it's hilarious to have a technique called upsetting because so many things in the studio can be upsetting um, in the very literal sense, but this time we're really, really <laughs> upsetting. So all you do is we're gonna take this and we're gonna run it down the edge a section at a time and then I'll, I'll, we'll do a little close up, but basically you'll see it just, it shines it up and it thickens up the edge so that because sometimes it isn't even what it looks like. It's just, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel finished, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I like one of these little guys. Okay, and remember, you know, when you use a flex shaft, you always wanna be, you know, your arms and everything really comfortable on the bench. So I'm just gonna pick a section here. And then I'll let you do a little close up. You see how it thickens it up and shines it up? You know, it's, it just makes it look finished. And sometimes that's the difference between a piece of jewelry being a pleasure, like not only to look at, but to touch and feel, you know what I mean? So it's just, it's just nice and smooth. So I'll do another little section just to show you what I mean, but literally that's it. It's really very much like if when you're using a Swifty wheel to polish a bezel edge, you know? Okay. You pick a little section, you make a few strokes, okay. you work your way around. It's not like you're gonna be sitting there like forever and ever. So it doesn't take long either, which, and then it doesn't need any finishing because like that's it, that's the finish. It's like shiny and a little bit thicker. All right. How it just, it's a little thicker, it's, you know. And like I said, you know, of course, everything with jewelry making is details because we're all, you know, big control freaks. <laughs> um, but I feel like this makes a big difference. And the thing of it is these tools are not crazy expensive. Like, and you buy one and they will probably last you, like, I don't know, I've had the same one for like a million years. So it's not like the kind of thing that's like particularly expensive or whatever. It's really quick to use, but I feel like, kind of raises the level a little bit of your jewelry, you know what I'm saying? Because I do feel like whether people know it or not, if they pick up a piece of your jewelry and the edge is a little, it, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it's just not as charming as we want it to be. So really easy, really fast. Uh, we have these on the website, you can get them. I mean, it, it's not like in a big set of them or anything, you just buy one and that'll pretty much do all of your uh, margin rollering needs. So just to show you an extreme close-up, like here's a section right in here that isn't done. You see what I mean? Like that's mm -hmm. the normal edge and then I'll like shift it around. So hopefully you can see. And then you see that right there? That's the part you have done. Hold on, close. You see what I mean? It just like, it thickens it up, makes it shiny. It just, and it really is a big, I think, tactile difference. Yeah, finishes the whole piece. Yeah, so it's one of those little things that like, it may be small, but I think it makes a huge difference.